Right, okay. So I take this off. Yeah. Although Although you are better looking with it on, Dom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a bit harsh, isn't it? <laughs> this Where time of the looking? morning. Yeah. Right, okay, so I'm here with Jason down the flying field. We brought a few new things down with us today. But um, the guys at Vifly sent us uh, a few gadgets. And we're going to show you one now that is kind of indispensable, if particularly if you're in the drone and quad racing quad, world. Quad right um, yeah. or anything FPV where you're likely to land out of sight or in long grass or something like that. So I actually use uh, a Vifly, the V2 version of this. This is the new mini version. So as far as I can tell, it does the same thing, um, but it's it's really small. Uh, I mean, the LiPo cell inside it, I haven't seen a LiPo cell that's, that size for for quite some time. So really, really small, ideal for really miniature aircraft. Um, and the idea of these is it's not a, it's a lost model alarm, which you can set off via your transmitter, um, or in the event of a crash, it will also beep. And the really nice thing about Vifly, which I haven't seen on a lot of other beepers, is they have a LiPo in them. So in the event of a big crash, and it all comes apart and cables become disconnected and your lipo goes flying in, in the other direction this will then start beeping once it's detected that the the main lipo has been disconnected from the aircraft so really handy little thing it saved me hours of finding my quad in long grass and up trees and stuff like that so up trees uh, absolutely yeah i mean you land a, a quad in a tree by accident and uh yeah if you if you don't know it's in a tree and you're looking on the ground it's it saved me quite uh, quite a few times why don't so. we ever film that <laughs> <laughs> so let's see what the little tiny new mini version does so as you can see this is the five fly finder <laughs> mini so Link will be in the video description and pin the comment if you want to get hold of one. But yeah. Yep. And Dom's going to go and find my quad when I crash it in the uh, in the long grass. Yeah. So, so I am going to uh, cover my eyes, <laughs> and you're going to take off and land somewhere, and then I will go find it. Absolutely. Yeah. And, and the nice thing, it uses the same connector as all the other Vifly products. So on my drone, I just literally disconnect the existing cable, take the the V2 out, and you can see the size difference there actually between the two. So quite a lot smaller, and connect it up. And Jason, just a quick question. Obviously this one, I'm guessing you've got a flickable switch so you can activate it. I do, yes. What if you lose all power? Will it still start beeping? It will just start beeping, yeah. You get like a, I think it's like a 15 second cool down period. Um, okay. where you said be this already, didn't you? He wasn't listening. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I don't know not? if I mentioned oh. that. The 15 <laughs> second cool down period, and then it will start beeping. Ah, okay. So, yeah, so let's try I'm ready. Are with you it, ready, Dom? Are you? With this fog, <laughs> with this fog today, you might just want it on permanently. <laughs> yeah, it's nice and warm actually. <laughs> it's worth noting that it's got a little uh, LED on to help you find it as well. So if I manually activate it, you can see the beeper flashing as well. Yeah. Right. I must capture Dom falling over when he can't see as well. <laughs> Actually, a better test will be a power loss. So I'm going to disconnect the battery, hide the quad, and then hopefully in I about... Are you going to fly out somewhere? No, because then you'll hear the motors beeping as well because the motors beep. Oh, so if I you. disconnect the power it's like it's oh, had a crash. Okay. So you're simulating a really hard crash? Yeah. All right. All right. So I can't cheat. Very clever, leaving some dummy footprints just in case he cheats. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have, I tell you what, I wouldn't have thought of that anyway. <laughs> Time to find it. Right, can I actually, I'll... All right, so I'm just gonna try and find it based on the beat. Works. Me 
it's it's not super loud, but it's loud enough. It's loud if enough to no, hear if it. If there's yeah. certainly nothing else going on for you to pick it up, and then you just press a button on it to deactivate it. Deactivate it, yeah. So really handy. I mean, I've been using them for quite some time. Not the mini version. This is a new version. But the, the standard version I've been using for some time and pretty much everyone I know that has freestyle quads also uses them um, or any kind of plane that's on FPV or even line of sight. I mean, you know yourself, when we've landed out in the crop, we've oh, had yeah. to get my drones out to find the models in the crop because you just can't see them. So yeah. a lot of clubs are like that, are surrounded by crops. Yeah, and so we, we've genuinely on models without Lost model alarms had to have got quads out to go and find these models. So, I mean, for, for what they cost, they're they're a, a brilliant tool. A small investment yeah. that could potentially save you hundreds. Absolutely, yeah. So that's uh, so. What's it called again? It's called the ViFly Mini. So ViFly Mini. Yeah. So if you're interested in this, then the link is in the product description, the video description, and the pinned comment. Look it up for the price. It's not a lot. It's just a few bucks, I think. And. Uh, so that's it really it. is mini, it doesn't weigh anything, does it? No, it's tiny. It don't, weight is not a concern, not even on a small quad with no. something that small. So thanks for watching. If you're interested in more essential RC flight tests and just general product tests like this, then please subscribe. You might want to click on the bell icon for notifications of our future uploads as well. But thanks for watching this one. Thanks to Jason for the competent demonstration no and Carl for being on camera. And uh, we'll see you next time. Cheers. See you next time. Cheers. Cheers.